Okay, welcome back. And these are the transmitters or senders that I've shown you before. And all four of these simulate analog broadcasting. And I actually have, now I actually have 11 of these, but they're not all being used. And actually, these really haven't been used now due to the fact that a signal could be bled over to an outside source. So these are now only on for testing purposes, like if I'm using a uh, portable TV and need to check the uh, status of a video that I'm doing, or if I need to check an analog TV for its performance uh, that isn't hooked up to cable. So that's the only time that these are on. So I have 11 of these and I want to show you another setup that I have that will also simulate the analog broadcast. And again, it's only in the house. Okay, here is the other type of video sender that I have. And actually, as you can see, it's a UHF modulator with a UHF modulator amplifier attached to it. And there's the antenna. And as you can see, the amplifier is on but the modulator is off and as long as the modulator is turned off there's no signal being carried over the airwaves and again as I said it is only restricted here in the house when you when you go outside uh, it doesn't it doesn't pass through the walls so that makes it safe to use if I need to have it running for a period of time but I do want to show you how it actually works and how it simulates the analog broadcast where here in the house I can actually have almost a dozen channels on analog TV once again so for this one I'm going to show it to you on the big TV that's over in the entertainment center okay here's channel 62 and as you know, that's the only analog channel that really, really exists here in the area. Now, what I'm going to do is tune this. And I'm going to zoom in so I could see the numbers for myself. I'm going to tune this to channel 31. And there it is on 31. And as you can see, there's nothing there. Absolutely nothing there. Now, that modulator that I just showed you is also tuned to channel 31. In fact, that modulator that I showed you can tune to channels 14 to 83. However, since a lot of the channels are no longer in existence for television broadcast, especially from the 70s on up, and now actually from 52 to 69, uh, some of those channels will not give a clear picture. So actually what I'm going to do is before we do channel 31 I have another modulator down here as you can see right here with the same setup and this one is tuned to channel 64 and the reason I have it tuned to 64 is just to give you a demonstration on how the signal can go through the channel but it's very 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 weak so there's no concern of it violating the airwaves because it's I mean the the signal is so weak like I said as soon as you walk outside it's gone the signals completely gone so let me find the remote for the TV and we'll be right back 
Okay, I found the, t uh, the remote for the TV, and that message that you're looking at at the bottom of the screen here, it says, not receiving a signal. Auto shut off in eight minutes. That means that the TV is going to turn off automatically because there's no signal going through. You can set up this TV to actually do that. So that way it's just not running, you know, a blank signal or snow for, you know, forever. So now what we're going to do is tune this to 64. And the numbers are actually up here when you punch them in. Let me show you. See, there's 64, 62. Okay, so now we're going to go back to 64 and we're going to zoom all the way out. now. What I'm going to do, let's see if I can do this with one hand, okay, I'm going to start my other camcorder, there's a tape in there, yeah, I was going to start it, oh, I have it unplugged because I'm charging a battery, so what, what I'll do is just turn the, the unit on so you can see how it simulates an on-air signal. And there it is. See? Now naturally there's nothing going through there, but that's what you would get if the modulator is turned on with even if there is a signal going through. You notice there's no more snow. Now, what I'm gonna do is change the channel on the TV. We're going to go down to 52, that used to be active, and now I'm just going to push the down button on the modulator, and there we are, it's now back on 52. So this modulator here is very easy to program. You know, you can you can adjust it to any channel you want. That says 53. Okay. Well, I was close. I was close. But anyway, that's how that modulator works. So in the next video, I'm going to show you all the others in action with something going through.